Hello everyone, welcome back to Fury Time channel. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for supporting me, guys. John Fury, the father of the WBC heavyweight champion Tyson Fury, expressed the desire to see his son fight against UFC champion John Jones. I don't want to watch Tyson fight John Jones in a staged fight. Let these two be the hell out of each other. Let John Jones do his thing and Tyson do his thing. Let these two tear each other to pieces and the survivor will raise his hands up and say, that's it, Fury said. John Jones had his last fight against Cyril Gann in March of this year at the UFC 285 tournament. In this confrontation, John Jones won by a technical knockout and won the championship belt in the heavyweight category. He has 27 victories and one defeat in his account. Fury last entered the ring against Derek Chisora in December 2022. This fight ended in favor of Tyson with a technical knockout in the 10th round. He has 33 wins, 24 by knockout, 1 draw and no defeat in the professional ring. Cult heavyweight Mike Tyson was asked to name the greatest performance in the history of heavyweight. Iron Mike surprised me. He remembered the Korean WBC champion, British Tyson Fury. Tyson was asked the name, the greatest performance in the history of heavyweight. Tyson believed that Fury had an amazing fight in February 2020, twice dropped. Strange that the WBC champion American knockout Deontay Wilder. I think it was one of them. One of the greatest performances of all time. These guys really did a great job. Both he and Mr. Wilder, they were doing boxing. Fury and Wilder had three fights. In the first, they failed to determine the winner. Tyson outplayed Deontay at the expense of pure boxing, but was close to an early defeat. In the rematch, the Briton unexpectedly confidently ran over the American, took away the championship belt. The third fight turned out to be the most beautiful. An old school swing with martial falls ended with a late knockout from Fury. Former UFC heavyweight champion Francis Ngano is preparing for his debut. Francis will not have an easy warm-up fight, but a battle with the best of the best. Therefore, Ngano decided to train for such a big challenge under the guardians of Legion. Iron Mike Tyson has the staff of specialists who help the Cameroonian. He teaches him his signature combinations. Mike controls the work on his mouth. Look at how his work hits the shells and generally monitors Nagano's physical fitness. And judging by the way the training process is going, it's uh, not easy for Francis. So from the preparation of the former UFC champion, the following aspects could be noticed. Mike tries to adapt in, uh, to the boxing pace. If in MMA Francis could pin an opponent to the net, stand and work a little in the clinch, then there will be no such respite in the ring. Here, the clinch doesn't last long and the referee quickly pulls the fighters apart, so again must be ready for a permanent job. Tyson focuses on combinational actions, who would adopt because this is the style of Mike himself. The main focus is the body blows. Francis is a practicing rapprochement. Dive with a blow to the torso and continue the attack at medium and short distances. As for Francis Nagano's ambitions, they are completely in order. Predator reminds that boxing is a sport with which he started and only then began to fully engage in MMA. In general, it is not difficult for him to adapt to boxing. Francis promises to shock the audience. Fury is really good and we are going to find out, but I guarantee that it will fall on the canvas. I'm excited because I will fight with the king of the mountain, and if I beat him, then I will become the best in boxing," Francis Nagano said. It is on time Francis noted the Britain's good ability for comebacks. Fury repeatedly found himself in the knockdowns, but each time he rose and won. Nagano immediately added that he hit would have a unique effect on the enemy. If he gets in, then the Gypsy King will no longer stand up. Well, there is no doubt about the monstrous power of the Predator. He is the most intimidating puncher in mixed martial arts. But can Francis be the same puncher in boxing? 
No matter what Francis claims, almost no one believed in his victory. Mike Tyson recently gave an interview in which he said the following praise. Francis is uh, trying very hard. He is a smart guy and he understands that this is a business. Business, not sports. That's how Iron Mike calls it. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.